Averse me, baby. We shall plunder at these southeastern seas. Aren't we in the north? No. This is the southeastern quadrant. Oh. So, uh, well, last time we explored the Goron Island, so let's uh, see if we can explore the rest of this. Oh, but first there's this ship over here. Let's uh, smash into it. Yeah. Let's uh, speed it up a bit. And then you go to the basement of this ship, and then she fights you, forgets her sword, and light back, and has the uh, stone tetra. Yep. Yeah. Okay, bye. Yeah, bye. Give me money. Thank you. Wait, not even money, goddamn. Okay, I, I think he gave all of his money to you. <laughs> so, I'm not sure if you noticed, but over there, there are some pirate ships. Pretty sure they're Viking ships? Ships. They float and they shoot stuff. Uh, so let's play with them. What if they're yachts? <laughs> Who knows? Then, uh, I guess we're plundering them? Watch out, the frame rates! Oh no! It's not too bad. Well, you know, your bombs are quicker than theirs. Yeah. I'm not sure how they get those bombs to fly so slowly, but yeah. Ambush. Oh no, ambush! Ah. You could have done that long ago. I kind of like how Lineback's box is right next to the steering wheel. Oh, that's it? That's it. <laughs> what? <laughs> um, <laughs> how courageous of you. <laughs> um, I expected maybe like bigger. Yeah, you would, you would kind of expect like those uh, Zora warriors, but nope, just three imps. The, okay. There were three ships. Uh huh. And there were two enemies. No, there were three imps. They just died in one hit. So, yep, that's um, <laughs> that's just that done, I guess. Um. Okay. <laughs> yep. You say so. Yeah. It's gonna get worse. Trust me. You mean better? Nope, worse. Come on, <laughs> a little bit of faith, please. Nope. Actually, you might like one part of um, whatever is coming up next. I like these guys. They need a lot of money. No, it's just one ruby every time, but it's it's something to do. So hey, here's some new enemy. It's like those bells it? from any uh, shoot 'em ups. <laughs> I'm not actually sure if I showed off those sarks before. Uh Look! Oh no, an, an island! island. <laughs> <laughs> Who knew there was an island ni nearby? Hmm. Well, you, you have to look. Sometimes listening isn't enough. I think Ciela might uh, want to invest in some, like, glasses or something. You know. Because he kind of spotted that really late. Yeah. Well, how can a fairy have glasses? Uh, the same way they they talk, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. Well, I mean, if they were to have glasses, making glasses would be really difficult. Cause yeah. Of how you have to manipulate the glass and why are we talking about this? Because it's more interesting than whatever is coming up next or right now, I guess. It sounds like a boring quest. Uh, actually, um, we got a letter from uh, Mr. Kleppy Goron. Work part time. We'll check that out later in this video. But hey, another courage gem! How Yay. courageous of you! Well, we did uh, save the Goron kid, I guess. I guess. 
I guess. Where? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Pretty good half-assed impersonation right there. Yep. So, take a guess why this kind of sucks. You have to dig for treasure. Mm -hmm. And it's not diving for treasure. Yeah. So basically, this the way this works is you uh, you pay fifty rupees and then you get to dig up up to ten treasures. But you, know. you can dig more than uh, ten times if you don't hit something immediately. But um, just wait a second. Pretty good. There is a reason why I'm uh, doing this. Whoa. N it's not that. You should try a different quadrant. It... What? Yeah. <laughs> so, the reason why I don't like this minigame is because it takes forever and you get rupees. Oh my god, that's such a dick move! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All this for, um, well, just two treasure charts. My god. That's fun, right? It's worse than chance time in Mario Party. Well, here's um, the first treasure chart. Yay. Hurry for that. One more to go. Mm -hmm. But really, this uh, minigame kind of sucks just because um, it's completely RNG. And when you're done, you have to leave the island. To reset it. So, yep. You look forward to seeing you again. Wah! Wah! It's kind of a. Uh, fitting for Gossip Stone to man the island. <laughs> I'm not even sure how it works. I'm not even sure if I want to know how it works. It's all a system deep in the tunnels. Yeah. Who knows what's underneath those uh, statues or stones. Well, they make a boing sound when you hit them. So are they mm -hmm. really statues? Yeah, every time you actually... What? What? Uh, reports. Oh. <laughs> well, you know, it's fool's gold. I think. I guess, maybe, I don't know. Uh, it's kind of dumb. Like, how, how do you lose rupees? Like, hey, this uh, rupee j you just picked up is worth, is so worthless that you um, have to pay up or something. It's all game gold. Like, you can't just throw it away or something. Uh, it's like the casino. <laughs> I hope there's a casino around here, well, around the world, that actually gives you negative money. <laughs> in your winnings. Like, psych, you little bitch, you shouldn't gamble like this. <laughs> That's what you get. Well, hey, high risk, high reward, right? Way too high risk, no reward. Yeah. What's worse is that I actually uh, make back all that money I spent in here. Even though I picked up so many rupees. Why are they called rupees? Because they make you poor. No, I mean, they could have thought of a better name than just a pun. <laughs> so, third time third time doing this, yay. Like, Zoopies. <laughs> Why Zoopies? Like, uh, stars in Mario Party. They give you negative. Aww. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's obviously better. <laughs> Oh hey, five rupees. 
so I guess there's uh, some sort of chance of getting a certain item. Mm -hmm. It's, as, I, as I've said, it's completely RNG. It doesn't even matter where you dig. Um, like, is yeah. it more likely that you get rupors than a single rupee? Mm, I think I'm just being very um, unfortunate. Or You're Dutch, it's not supposed to happen. No. My money! Hey, check this one out. Yay! Yeah. How many are there? Two? Three? Just two. So yeah. I'm pretty much done here. Thankfully. First of all, let's get poor. Oh, let's uh, get the money back. Oh. Let's find out. Yay! Whoa! You got so lucky I, there. So I basically made all my money back. Worth which it. is nice, yeah. Now time-wise, it's not worth it. Still got the treasure maps. Yeah, first time I uh, did this, I just went like through it and uh, went along. I didn't, I didn't really uh, bother with 100%ing the treasure maps. Which uh, every sane person should do, by the way. Where to now? Off to exploring and scavenging shit and shooting seagulls. They don't give you money, stop shooting them. I'm still waiting for a cease and desist by PETA. Wait, what? PETA, the, the pet organization. I already talked about this. Oh, right. Mm. Um, oh, right. Those guys. Uh. They look like Cracko. Those guys don't really do anything at all. Just fly. Yeah. You yeah, almost got him. But hey, new frogs. Also, that. Oh, where'd that come from? This island has um, an interesting shape. <laughs> I didn't see that. <laughs> Should have been a circle. Not an right. issue. It's an Omega Frog. And I know that's a really half-assed drawing. Not really. At least it's not the sun. <laughs> you will never redeem yourself. <laughs> well, usually what I do is I draw the bottom parts first and then I draw the arc in the middle. Which I didn't do when drawing that, I guess. <laughs> you really had to use the... Like, a scope? Uh... Well... I think Ciela really needs glasses. I mean, come on. It's right in front of you. <laughs> it's a huge stone Nintendo DS. Oh, so that that's what it is. Hmm. So, uh, take a guess what this island is called. Uh. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. So, uh, the gimmick of this island is that it's shaped like a DS. A fat one. At that. Are you sure? Yeah. And um, on the place where all the holes are, on the thing itself, like for the speakers and whatnot, um, and the microphone right here, there usually is something down there. Like snake, snake nests. nests. What? I'm scared of playing my DS now. I hope <laughs> snakes will come out of them. The lower screen's menu button. Hmm. They're breaking the fourth wall over everything now. Yeah, I know. We're playing on the console we're playing on right now. Uh, I think I just confused myself. <laughs> no, I just didn't want you to put it like an Inception joke. <laughs> nah. Everyone knows. A beehive, underground beehives. Oh god. Oh no. What's out next time you uh, dig up your... Yes, a speaker holes. Yeah. Um. Yeah, it's it's weird. Shuffle bees, the wicker man's around. <laughs> I kind of like it though, honestly. 
Like, it, it's something different. For once. Did you get hit? Well, just by the... Brock 2. What's even more puzzling is, how the hell do you get underground beehives? Like... Uh, actually, there are some, like, ground beehives. Are there? Like, the, they... I'm pretty sure there are. Like, there are some, um, nests that bees actually create, uh, on the ground. Also, that was a really sweet spinach egg, don't deny it. I was too busy talking about bees. Ah, oh, damn it. And how honey is good for you. Wait, when did you mention honey? Not really. I mean, were you talking about me? No. <laughs> no, let's not go any further. <laughs> uh. After this video, sweetie. <laughs> oh god. Uh. Oh hey, Big Red Rupee. Yay. Hooray. We're getting closer to our uh, 1600 rupee mark for the hot container. Oh yeah, that's right. What a good thing. Yep. But yeah, I, I do think it's worth uh, digging up every one of these holes. The Gorons do not agree with that, apparently. Uh, what? The Gorons do not agree with that. They didn't hit, dig the holes. Didn't think there would be money in there. <laughs> kind of fucked that up. Well, I don't think Gorons usually uh, have shovels. Cyclops. Yeah. You get stuff. From uh, getting them. Oh my god, that's kind of gruesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I kind of like that, like hitting both at the same time. And as a reward, we get a Rupor. How courageous of you. Another courage gem. Yay. Did they, like, forget to, uh,. Implement courage gems when they were finished with the game. They were like, "Oh shit, that's right." <laughs> they just decided to play yeah, it everywhere. I, mm, I'm not sure. I think it's just by coincidence that I'm I keep getting uh, courage gems. But um, all that digging isn't really the main draw of this island. You're pretty much killing the Nintendo DS. Yeah, pretty much. Also, the Gossip Stone was mentioning the menu button on the touchscreen, which is always at the bottom left. For more Courage Gems. How courageous of you! Yeah, I, uh, I uh, risked my touchscreen. But yeah, the main draw of this island is... Uh, a minigame. So, I, um, I hope you like liked the um, Goron gameplay from the previous temple. Oh, there's more? Because that's uh, a skill you get to utilize here. Ooh. I'm interested. It's it's nice. I like it. Yeah, brother. Yeah, brother. <laughs> That wasn't really uh, Jamaican enough. Yeah, brother! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that works. 35 seconds and 0 milli milliseconds. Hmm. Okay. You can do it. So, uh, I don't really think I really need to explain anything here. You just gotta just collect all the gems. Yeah. Not really collect them, you smash them, but yeah. Man, I'd be scared if there were some sort of Goron just rolling around my DS. <laughs> As you're playing this, uh, an actual Goron rolls over your DS. Most people don't notice it because they're too busy uh, playing this minigame. Huh. Almost five seconds to spare. Nah, it's not all of it. What? 
<laughs> yeah, it's kind of a dick move. But now that we know the way the course course is uh, shaped, I guess uh, we can do it a bit faster next um, time. Um, how? How what? How do you open that chest from the middle when you were at the left one? Magic fingers. It's kind of scary. <laughs> well, didn't you know that Link had telepathy? Wait, wait, what? Telepathy? Yeah. <laughs> this came out wrong. Oh well. So, hey, mini game. I I like it. It's. Not nearly as tedious as most other mini games, at least. Archery. Ah. Oh. So even with me bumping into the walls every time, um, I still make it. Nice work, and Link gets the prize. Yep. So what is this? Some sort of bet? Nah, it's just. Uh, yeah, that. <laughs> After collecting the bomb tube back, you can do this minigame again to get ship parts and money. So, if that's what you like to do, then uh, yeah, you can do that. Alright. I might actually end up doing that at some point, but not now. Off screen, maybe? Yeah, like for collecting all the ship parts, uh, I think I might do that at some point, but. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe it's just me. This island has a different shape. I wonder why. Is this some sort of deja vu for you, Lineback? Obviously, it's uh, Lineback playing the game. You are Lineback. No, I'm, I'm just talking over a video made by Lineback. So, hey, it's Beetle. He has nothing to sell. Except one good thing. Oh no, we already bought that. This price is crazy! Oh my god, I'll buy it! <laughs> 50 rupees for a sort of plastic crown? Let's go! <laughs> Ooh. Drill Pro! Whoa! Whoa, I already have that one. <laughs> a shitty chimney that costs more than a drill. <laughs> well, hey, you gotta have priorities. Priorities on what? On. Um, Pricing, obviously. No wonder nobody bought it. No wonder. Oh no, more of these guys. They still don't do anything. Yep. <laughs> what the hell? Uh, where they come from? Are they made by clouds? I don't know. But, uh... So hey, do you remember those guys from Wind Waker that uh, kind of stared off into the distance at other islands? Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> uh, you can take that off, sir. Your eye is red. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, they come from the Ho-Ho tribe. So, I guess this is... a. Mm. The ho ho tribe of the way away people. Ho oh, ho! Yeah, this is basically uh, as much back backstory you're gonna get about these guys. So, what? Are these guys like Napoleon ripoffs? Pretty much, yeah. With pilgrim hats? <laughs> <laughs> this one actually uh, lost his thingy. Well, he better bore it, so he can find it with his, uh, scope. That's, um... Gonna be something to take note of, like, that, uh, telescope thingy. Why, those faces are scary, though. Jesus. <laughs> Stop looking at me! <laughs> it's scaring me. Yeah. It's... Mm, it's different. You might want to have your eye checked... ...by one of nah. your people. Oh no, they all have that. So hey, look at this island. We can't dock, just shoot it. 
Well, that's uh, what we're gonna do. Oh. Well then. I'm not, I'm not sure how this works, but it, it, it somehow does. After I finish drawing this. Don't sail where the fish is. You might kill it. <laughs> Yeah, to unlock this island, you have to oh. do this, and I'm not sure how this works, but it does. Oh. And it takes a while, so... You know what's, uh, weird? What? Th they're not crumbling down, they're just falling. Mm-hmm. Which is even weirder. So hey, guess um, what the next temple is gonna be like. The Crystal Temple. Uh, close enough. Gotta get every element mm -hmm. of the periodic table. <laughs> no, don't. Let's go for the Zirconium Temple. We should have done this video for Christmas. Oh no! <laughs> it's too late for that, we're still in winter though. We can redeem <laughs> ourselves. Close enough, right? The fish people. Right? Right. Left. Over. See you next time. No.